Hey guys, Erwin Tech here. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to install Baldi's Basics on your Chromebook. Before we start today's video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe to my channel, and turn on those post notifications so you get notified whenever I upload brand new videos to my channel. Another way of supporting me and my channel is you can buy my memberships. They're linked in the description below as always, or you can hit that little join button right next to the subscribe button and gain access to loads of monthly perks such as gifts, GIFs, emojis, badges next to your name in live streams and comments. You can also get a secret members only Discord and secret members only live streams. That's all. <laughs> start this tutorial you'll need linux mode enabled i have a video linked in the description below for you guys to watch on how to turn on linux mode on your chromebook in short you just hit the menu key go to the search bar and type settings then hit enter then what you want to do is go to the very bottom right here when it says linux beta click on that then click turn on but if you want a more in-depth video go to the one linked in the description below after that just close your settings app and then go to this google doc which will be linked in the description below as always then what you want to do is go to this website which is also linked in the description below as always go to this website this one is going to be the first one we're going to go to then what you want to do is scroll down to the download links at the very bottom right here keep going down and do baldy 143 linux.zip click download on that and wait for it to done be downloading in the bottom right hand corner of your screen so once it's done just click show and folder as always and then what you want to do after you've clicked show in folder it will highlight the file but then what you want to do is drag it into your linux files then let go and the file will start copying into your linux files and see now it's complete then you want to close your files app close this and you can close the website if you want to then go to this google doc which will be linked in the description below as always then what you want to do is hit the menu key go to the search bar type terminal then hit enter then what you want to do is highlight the first command, highlight it, right click, then go to copy, click on that, go back to your terminal, do a simple right click, then hit enter. It will unzip all of those files that will be in your Linux files. Then what you want to do is do the number two command, highlight it, right click, click copy, go back to your terminal, right click, then hit enter. It should do nothing just like that. Then you want to do the number three command. Highlight it, right click, click copy, go back to your terminal, right click, then hit enter, and Baldi's Basics will launch up on your Chromebook. You can choose your screen resolution. I'm just going to choose this one. Input, you can mess with this. Make sure all my graphics stuff is correct, then just hit OK, and the game will launch up on your Chromebook with all of your dedicated stuff. Okay, warning, this is a horror game. Just press to continue. Let's see, I can start the game, hit start to play. Um... Let's see, endless mode and load. I guess we're loading into Baldi's Basics right now so we can play the game. Okay, so basically any lag at all. So I guess I have to find notebooks for him to like not chase me and win the game. But after you're done with the game, you can just hit escape and then hit yes. And then go to the menu. You can go to just back and then you can just hit this little stop sign button right here to exit out of the game. When you're done with the game, you just hit that little exit button right there at the top I just showed you. But now we're going to create a desktop shortcut for it so you can click on it without doing all the commands over and over again. Then what you want to do is do the number four command, highlight, right click, click copy, go back to your terminal, right click, then hit enter and then click Y on your keyboard, then hit enter and wait for all that packages to done be installing. After it's done installing, you do the number five command or type menu libre, then hit enter and the app will launch up on your Chromebook. Then what you wanna do is select the games tab right here. Then what you wanna do is hit the plus icon up here, click on that. Then you wanna select add launcher, click on that. Then you wanna name your launcher Baldi's Basics. Then go to this little thing that says command right here. Hit the files logo right there. Then go to home and do baldy x86 under 64. Select that right there. Then hit OK. And then hit this little save launcher button up here. Click on that. And then after you've saved the launcher, close menu libre. Close the terminal. Hit the menu key. Go up and find your Linux apps. For me, it'll be right here. Then Baldi's Basics will be right here. Just click on it when you want to launch it. And Baldi's Basics 
basics will launch up on your Chromebook. Just hit OK, and the game should launch up as normal. Just click on it, and then you can play Baldi's Basics on your Chromebook. Now you guys can have fun playing it on your Chromebook. Enjoy. Thank you all for watching. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe to my channel, and turn on those post notifications so you get notified whenever I upload brand new videos to my channel. Another way of supporting me and my channel is you can buy my memberships. They're linked in the description below as always, or you can hit a little join button right next to the subscribe button and gain access to loads of monthly perks such as gifts, emojis, badges, and much more that were featured in the beginning of the video. Also, another perk to subscribing to my channel is you can comment down below i subscribed and i'll give you a shout out in my next video so here are those people who commented down below i subscribed go subscribe to their channel search them up on youtube and show them some support that's all for now and i'll see you all next time bye